my brother tbg just put out a new song the link is in the description below i'm very sure you're gonna like it tbg i interviewed him recently the song has been out for like two days now so go download it okay guys i want to give special thanks to those that have been you know helping me out in this whole thing like i'm not the only person in this this beautiful subscribers who send me messages about news and most of the time it's the news i get to talk about the next day okay they just draw my attention to new stuff's happening around the entertainment industry in nigeria thank you guys and welcome to my channel Okay guys, today I'm gonna start off by talking about Bonaboy. Okay, I know some of you guys will be like, oh, why Bonaboy every day? Don't you have any other news to talk about? I have other news to talk about. If you're a new subscriber, you know, I wouldn't blame you for that. But if you're an old subscriber, come on, you understand how it goes around here. Like, I will always follow up till the end. I'm sorry, okay? It's been like three days in a row, like, I've been talking about this guy. Uh, and that's because stories have been coming up about him right now we've got new reports about bonaboy bonaboy has been granted bail i don't know what's gonna happen after that but being out on bail doesn't make you innocent okay you can be released on bail at the police station after you've been charged this means you will be able to go home until your court hearing if you are given bail you might have to agree to conditions bonaboy's conditions were two responsible shorties why the matter was adjourned till 29th of december so i'm gonna update you guys on that according to reports bonaboy did not disclose anything to these security operatives about the armed robbery <laughs> i don't know why this armed robbery took place on 22nd of october so bonaboy after being questioned did not disclose it and he was granted bail on the thousand naira bill he was even escorted in suv after arraignment just to let you guys know that bonaboy was arrayed on two count charge first is accessory after the fact and conspiracy okay now in case you're wondering that what is the meaning of accessory after the fact it means a person who assists someone to commit an arrestable offense here are the list of things that were stolen from mr 2k an automatic gold wristwatch valued at $25,000 and gold jewelry valued at 1.5 million naira and iPhone 7 valued at 380,000 naira a Samsung Galaxy S7 valued at 240,000 naira a Samsung Galaxy S5 worth 110,000 naira Adidas shoes valued at 75,000 naira three bottles of perfume worth 180,000 and a cash sum of 45,000 naira and this robbers claim that Brabo was the one that sent them to steal from him and also you know teach him a lesson let us move on to the next news we have a girl as in according to report this girl is about 16, 16 or so this lady tattoos whiskey's face on her back and she claims she's a diet fan of Wiz wheezy and we're gonna watch the video i have the video for you guys it's a permanent tattoo and she was asked that what about parents what do they have to say about this and she says you know they know she's a dad fan of whiskey and also a future husband you're gonna watch the hilarious video uh but it's just crazy to see you know things like this online very very crazy let us quickly watch the video as whiskey with has whiskey on her back guys stab what did you say it's permanent guys did you hear that it is permanent oh my god star boy hey all right i'm sure whiskey is going to see this and i'm sure he's going to I, uh, seriously this is, no 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 I'm, I'm i'm really impressed what's this again diana yeah my name your name oh your name and whiskey's name starboy what did your parents have to say about this they know i'm a dire fan of whiskey so they're cool with it so your dad saw it and he was like okay. they're all cool with it okay what about your husband like your future i'm husband? not married yet so and it's permanent <laughs> so your future husband is going to see it uh, I don't have a plan of getting married. So you don't want to get married? Uh, because the girl I'm in love with is Whiskey. You are in love with Whiskey? Yeah. So you want to get married to Whiskey? I don't know, but I'm not oh saying. Oh my god. Oh my <laughs> god. This so. is like, this is love I from. Didn't so. but oh my god. Seriously, it's very, very funny. She says she's so in love with Whiskey. And I think Whiskey replied this lady after this was shared. You know online whiskey said where she do so that is it about wheezy 
and the next news we have it's our boy David just signs a deal with First Bank. Okay, so congratulations to David on your new deal. He says, Me and my new family, First Bank Nigeria, so many new projects and ideas coming. We also can't wait for December 27th. The 30 billion gang concert is on the 27th of December. So, shout out to Davido. Davido is such an amazing guy. Seriously, this guy has been working right from the start, even though he's from a rich background. He works like every day. He's also getting deals from everywhere as a result of his hard work. So, shout out to Davido. The last news we have today is Liu Kesh in bed with mannequin they spend the nights together i don't know why he posted this picture online maybe for publicity stunt but he said he slept with this you know one of those nights that you really need some calling to sleep i was desperate and this little angel came through for me had a peaceful night and woke up so refreshed get you a cuddle partner if you're single too and thank me later um single life the only thing left for him right now is mannequin since it's lonely at night you know that crazy night that you're lonely, single, and you have no option that to spend your nights with a mannequin. It's crazy. Guys, let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. This is very, very funny. Seriously. Thank you guys for watching. Until we see you next time. Peace.